Plans to expand Lee Canyon appear to be moving forward. The U.S. Forest Service has released an environmental impact review. Now that document analyzes the potential impacts on the forest and the wildlife that lives there. News Now reporter Karen Castro is live up near Lee Canyon with more on what happens next. Karen? Well, Christiane and Brian, based on the findings on that review, the U.S. Forest Service is authorizing the expansion, but we should mention that review is only a draft. They haven't made a final decision. There are still several steps ahead of the uh, expansion uh, plan, and inc it includes public input. A quick day trip for the Cervantes family, away from the heat and in touch with nature. Just getting away from the craziness. Sometimes we need a little break. Soon, there may be more recreational options at Lee Canyon for families that enjoy the outdoors. After an 18-month environmental impact study, the U.S. Forest Service has released a draft of the findings. For the Forest Service, we're uh, charged with, you know, um, allowing for enjoyment and use of the forest, but at the same time, you know, protecting it. Under the proposed plans, Lee Canyon would double in size and be open year-round. The expansion includes mountain biking and hiking trails, a zip line, a mountain coaster, and additional lifts and ski runs, just to mention a few. The U.S. Forest Service analysis shows the project won't cause major destruction on the canyon. Um, we're actually not looking at, you know, constructing uh, what you think of as a typical wide ski run, it's actually more just selective tree cutting. An endangered species calls Lee Canyon home. The U.S. Forest Service believes the project will benefit the blue butterfly. The plant that the um, butterfly is dependent on is, is de depends on disturbing disturbance in nature. But the organization Center for Biological Diversity disagrees, saying in part, quote, the butterfly needs undisturbed slopes of wildflowers and forbs for nectar and for laying eggs. Introducing thousands of mountain bikers to its fragile habitat could cause its demise. The U.S. Forest Service is taking public comment on the project for the next 45 days and will release a final decision as early as December. If all goes as planned, construction can begin by next summer. We like hiking and, you know, getting outdoors, so that's always fun. Um, so I think a new trail would be awesome. Now, the project is expected to take at least 10 years to complete at a cost of $35 million. Now, to read the full environmental impact study and to learn more about that public input period, head on over to LasVegasNow.com. Reporting live, Karen Castro, 8 News Now.